Hey guys, I'm making a video for Edgar's Rules Quest for RuneScape 2007. Um, on the screen, you're going to see the items that are needed for the quest. You can start the quest by talking to Sam Few in Taverly. He's upstairs in the Herbler shop. Um, he's going to ask you to go get a certain type of um, weed. So basically, what you have to do is you have to go to Trollheim. To get here, you're gonna have to have your climbing boots and you're gonna teleport to the games room. And then from there, you're gonna run through the through the rocks thing. So basically, just follow the path. It's a pretty long walk. So, yeah. Also, you gotta be careful for trolls and the uh, ranger trolls because they can hit pretty hard. And if you're low level, you might die. So, yeah, you just keep going down the path. Over here is where you gotta start be um, being careful. Just pray melee if you have pray melee. If not, just tank them or bring a couple of food. Alright, once you get here, you're gonna wanna go around the spiral. But when you see the yellow dots, you gotta pre range because they hit pretty hard. They hit constant sixes. So that can add up and kill you. So you're going to keep going around the spiral until you get to the top and once you get to the top you're going to go into the cave and you're going to talk to Edgar. Ok so once you enter the cave, talk to him and tell him that you got to find some goat weed. He'll tell you that the troll cook, uh, I think his name is Burnt Meat, he knows how to get it. So you gotta go into the troll stronghold. Basically, uh, you gotta go west of the spiral. So once again, there's a lot of walking. Be careful with the trolls here and be careful with the trolls inside. Once you get here, talk to Burnt Meat and ask him how to get goat weed, and he'll tell you that he wants a human because he's hungry and he's tired of eating goat. So you're like, what the fuck? And you have to go and get a human. So for this, you gotta go back and talk to Edgar. So you gotta go back upstairs, through the cave, into the spiral, and into his cave. You talk to him and you ask him how we're gonna do this, and he tells you that you're gonna get a parrot from the Ardugni Zoo, and you're gonna dress him up as a human. So if you have a teleport, you can teleport to Ardugni. If not, teleport to Camera and walk from there. Once you're here, head to the zoo and talk to Parody P. He's the first guy you see. Once you talk to him, ask him what do you feed them. And he'll tell you that they like pineapple junk. I accidentally talked to him again by accident. So you only need to talk to him once. So now, be careful and use your vodka with the pineapple chunks. By accident, I drank the vodka. Thank God I had two. So just use it with the pineapple chunk, and you get alcohol chunks. So now you gotta use these with the hole on the left side of the cage.
right here and you're gonna get a parrot a drunk parrot now you gotta take this back to Edgar so once again walk all the way to troll him set a board of bird therapy walk through the plains alright you're gonna tell him that you got a parrot and you're gonna ask him how we're gonna make him look like a human he basically tells you that with all the items you have in your inventory you can make them look like a human the chicken is to make them taste like a human and the grain is to make I have no idea what the grain is for <laughs> but first you gotta go <clears throat> and let me see I forgot what you have to do okay yeah you gotta go put the parrot in the uh, torturing chamber thing So once again, go back into a troll stronghold. Being careful with the trolls. Don't get hit too hard, especially if you're a low level or one defense gear. Down the stairs and down these stairs to the west. You're going to see a torture rack. So just use your parrot with the rack and you're automatically going to put him under it and you're going to leave him there for a while. So now you got to teleport a Falador and walk to Taverly because we got to get some robes from a guy washing them in the river or the lake. Just walk to Taverly. <laughs> So talk to this guy and tell him, oh, it's a pretty good day to do laundry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And write, Sam, uh, just click on Sam, he won't be happy, and he'll give you his dirty rope. So once again, go back to Edgar and show him the items you collected. And he'll tell you that's everything. So now you gotta get, well now you have to make a, um, a troll truth potion. So what you have to do is you gotta go to the top of the hill and you gotta pick something from the floor. There you go, pick the thistle. And what I have not put in the guide because I kind of messed up is you basically have to take the thistle to the west and burn it on, on a fire. You can't use this fire, so you have to go west. There's a couple fires over there. Just burn it, then use on uh, your preston mortar to grind it, and then put it back in to your potion to make a potion to make a truth potion. So um, that's what you see in my inventory in the troll potion. Take it back to Edgard. And he'll give you the scarecrow. Oh no, you have to go get your parrot. So once again, go back into the uh, stronghold where you left the parrot down the stairs to the west. Search the rack, and you're gonna get a parrot screaming, Oh, something with my spleen. So you. He's heard enough about torture. Take him back to Edgar. And now he'll give you the the fake human. So now you gotta take the fake man to the cook. Give it to the cook and he'll be pretty happy that you give that you give him a human. And he'll tell you how to get the goat weed. So basically, all you have to do now is search a drawer to the southeast. There's two, so search the first one. And you get a key, storage key. So now you're going to go south, uh, north of that, and down the stairs.
Okay, so here's probably the trickiest part of the quest. It's not really that hard. I failed a couple times. So, I mean, it's okay to fail. Just You just get teleported out and try again. Basically, what you have to do is you have to get to the far south of the room without getting caught by the by the guards. I mean, they can see you, but they can't hit you. So as you can see, the first couple times I failed, they deal a couple damage. So what you want to do is you want to wait for this guard to. Let me show you. You want to wait for that guard to move, follow him, wait for this one to pass, and then go into the little square room that you have right there. So now from here you're gonna wait, and then you're gonna run to the same square, but to, that's to the left of you right now. So I decided to wait a couple seconds before doing it. anything, so now I mess up again. Once you're here, you wanna wait again, and then you're gonna go through that passage to the south of you, and then straight to the crates at the very south. So wait for this <clears throat> guard to pass and just run for it and search the crate. You're going to get a goat, goat weed. It doesn't matter if you get hit. All you have to do now is set up for the Fatador, walk to Taverly, and turn in the herb to Sandview and Taverly and quest complete. So once you're here, just talk to him. And he'll be very grateful, and you get 11,000 Herbler experience, which is pretty good. And you get the ability to teleport to Trollheim without having to walk all the way, which is probably one of the best things if you're going to do Desert Treasure or in the future God Wars Dungeon. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the guide, and thank you for watching. Subscribe if you liked it, and I'll be putting out more guides in the future. Thank you.